welcome to Wicked Wrapping. My name is Megan and I'll be your guide to everything baby wearing and beyond. Today we're going to be doing a tutorial on how to do an eyelet carry, also known as a symmetrical double poppins. So in the tutorial today we're going to be doing the eyelet carry and the wrap that we have here with us is Woven Rainbow's Jewel Rainbow version 4 and um, it is a little bit of a grippier wrap but um, it's nice and sturdy so it's perfect for this carry. You're going to start off center so your middle marker you want to be in the middle of your chest and you're going to measure around to your back and that is where you're going to start baby on your back. You're going to do it like a ruck so you'll start a traditional ruck so you'll get baby up on your back um, and this is best done with a base or base plus one um, if you like to tie it with the extra tails and this is a 4.8 meter so this is my base and I'm going to get my baby. All right, so we have Echo here with us today, and I've already got her up on my back. You can go ahead and do that however you wish. And you're going to start off center um, in a ruck type, so you've got her um, in her nice deep seat there, and um, she's nice and high on your back. You'll have a long tail and a short tail. The long tail you're going to pin between your knees or between your legs somehow, and the short tail is going to go down, under, making sure that you're keeping your tension so you don't lose baby's seat. And you're going to go under and make your first chest pass. So the chest pass that you're gonna make on this side, just kind of spread it out, make it nice and tight. Top and bottom reels all nice and tight. And you're going to fold it around and you're gonna pin it underneath baby's bottom to hold its place. And just kinda of lift up baby. And pin it down underneath there. Okay? He giggled in. All right, so now that side is nice and secure. You're going to pull your other side. And so you've got it nice and tight. Now you're going to leave some slack here um, so that you can make your other um, your other poppins because this is also known as the symmetrical poppins. So this side is now going to go up and over the opposite shoulder, your long tail. Again, you're leaving a little bit of slack so that you can create that poppins. You're going around baby in the back, creating another seat. Remembering to leave a little bit of slack there in the front. And then you're going to go through your loop. Now you're gonna tighten your second chest pass. You're gonna tighten through Oh, very nice. Oh, yeah. oh thank you. <laughs> that was story. <laughs> she was showing me a leaf that she found. All right, so now we're tightening, and creating your chest pass, and your second poppins here. All right, now you're going to kind of untuck what you had tucked before with your short tail. And you can see that that eyelet's already starting to form and you're going to spread your passes out. Go around back, tie it off, and then we'll fix our chest passes. This is a nice grippy wrap. All right, so now we're going to fix our chest passes. There's one. And there's two. Fix our shoulder passes up here. There you have it. There's that nice eyelet carry. The symmetrical double poppins carry is another name for it. Um, but it's a nice sturdy, it's got a nice belt here in the front, so it doesn't tug on those shoulders. Baby's nice on your back. Not going to go anywhere. Say hi. 
And there you have it. If you have any comments, please leave them down below. Always remember to like and subscribe and have a wicked wrapping time. Bye-bye.